Namaste and a warm hello to all my friends. I pray you and your families are doing awesome. There are some lives that touch us so profoundly that they make you feel that you have to emulate those lives. And then one fine day, they go back to the source from where we all came. And you are left with that feeling of emptiness, that that hope, that wish that you had met them once. So with this theme in mind, I wish to talk about Kamla Bhaseen Ma'am, who spearheaded the feminist movement in India. I love Kamla Ma'am and I really pray you are happy wherever you are, Ma'am. I first heard about uh, Kamla Bhaseen Ma'am through Runudi and uh, Shipra in a gender workshop, which I attended in 2016. And in that workshop, I was given two booklets which were penned by Kamla Ma'am. I read both those booklets in an hour, so well written. And that was a moment when I decided that I have to meet this remarkable woman. One day I will meet this remarkable woman. Come what may, I will meet this remarkable woman. But fate had willed otherwise. Last year on 25th September, 2021, Kamla Basin ma'am moved on and all those who knew her were left with the deepest hole possible in our hearts. I really wish I'm able to touch even at least one life in my lifetime in the way Kamla Bhaseen Ma'am touched millions of lives through her music, through her passion, through her spirituality. She went through hell in her life, but she emerged from tops in all those situations. I salute to you, ma'am. I love you, ma'am. Even though I've not been able to see you in this lifetime, but I'm very sure I will definitely connect with you one day. So in this video, I really want you all to know about this remarkable woman. Kamla Basin, ma'am, was born on 24th April, 1946 in Shahida Valley village in Gujrawala district in Punjab. One of six siblings, she moved with her family to Bharatpur in Rajasthan, where her father worked as a doctor. Her mother was a homemaker. Kamla was educated in Jaipur. She became an icon of India's women's movement. Her spirit, slogans, poetry, songs, writings and speeches resonated with all and made her stand out as a leader in the feminist movement. Kamla co-founded Sangat, a South Asian women's network in April 1998. She was also a co-founder of Jagori, a women's right NGO in India. She wrote and published books, booklets, songs and stories, many of which have been reproduced in about 30 languages. An integral part of the global 1 billion rising movement. She was one of the coordinators for the 1000 women for the Nobel Peace Prize initiative in 2005. Personal loss and tragedy motivated her to seek a deeper meaning of life and spirituality. She became a follower of Thij Nan Han and Buddhist philosophy though she remained receptive to all religious teachings. Kamla was generous in her support of new ideas and actions. I'm so grateful to the Azad Foundation. I have picked up this information from their website. They are organizing this Kamla Bhaseen Award and uh, I will be putting the link for that. I really want you to check that out. And let us pray to become as influential as Kamla ma'am was. Love you ma'am. And I pray for you. 
may you be happy and blessed at the ultimate home where we all will go one day. Namaste. Thank you so much for listening to me. Have a great, great day.